Hello guys, Nick Z. Just wanted to show you this Mazili yoke geofusion contraption here that is now hooked up to 650 watts worth of bulbs there. This is a 150 watt floodlight and five uh, 100 watt bulbs. It's all the sockets that I have at the moment. So anyway, I'm going to turn it on here. I've also tuned it a little bit with these uh, magnetite magnets in here. Although they're not in perfect orientation um, because once I got them in the core I couldn't really move them around much. But it does help at times. And uh, I still need to have more capacitors for the the output side here. I need a whole line of capacitors there. That would help greatly. I just haven't been able to get them yet. And uh, there's a couple things I need, like the Zener diodes and to replace uh, maybe I don't know use the UF series diodes and so forth. Need to be able to crank some some amps through this this device here. So anyway, I'll turn it on now and you can see what it does. Okay, there it goes. So this is 500 watt bulbs and 150 watt floodlight, so 650 altogether. The core is ringing. Most vets are getting hot. So I disconnect the unit because I really don't have that down yet until I get the zeners in there to see if it keeps the MOSFETs cool or not. So anyway, that's the, the current setup and I'm about to do something else with the yoke so I just wanted to record it and show what I've got it up to 650 watts load but not 650 watts output. Uh, I'm not sure what the output is actually. It's reading 160 volts on my meter, but it doesn't mean much. <laughs> That's just what it says. So anyway, hope you liked it. And uh, we'll see what else I can come up with. Thanks for watching, guys. Yeah.